What is up, party people? It's your boy. My back hurts. And we have an unusual pain in our back. I have this unusual pain in my back. You should rest in bed at home. Oh. Don't get lost. Fire! Impossible. My fire protection sensors would already have detected the emergency. You have built-in fire protection sensors? Yes, ever since you turned eight years old, you little brat. That was my last birthday with my dad. I got a cake. I think I even remember the fireworks. I remember them too. Incredible how much you achieved with just eight candles. Robbery! Impossible. My theft protection sensors would already have detected the emergency. You have built-in theft protection sensors? All emergency prevention tasks are united in one person, and that's me, as you very well know. A small village like Kuvac is just not big enough to have a doctor's practice, a fire department, and a police station separately. Or at least, that's what I thought. Ever since you turned eight, I'm not so sure about that anymore. No emergency. My bad. If you say so, it sounds too good to be true. Um, that one. Could you leave me alone with her for a moment? No. But no. Bummer. Uh, thanks for your time. Well, thanks for your time. You're welcome. Not literally. Hey, gold. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Very good diagnosis, doctor. Oh, Can we, well, uh, it's just that I'm an expert in sleep. Can we oh. set fire to it's the possible. box? Or is that a no fire symbol? I can't tell what that is. The cardboard box. What's that funny smell? Ah, fire! The town hall's on fire! Fire control mode activated. Firefighter Gizmo at your service. Where is the fire? Over there. The chamber's on fire. Good lord. Don't worry. Your fire will be extinguished in no time. Take the stethoscope. Wow, we are just a uh, murderous bastard. I'm getting worried I'd have to camp in the cupboard forever. Whoop. Where was I? Ah, yes. Medical mode activated. Dr. Gizmo at your service. How's the patient? I'd say her condition hasn't changed. Leave the diagnosis to the doctor, will you? All right, where is my stethoscope? It's gone. Thieves! Crime in progress. Police mode activated. Officer Gizmo at your service. I'm having no like an identity crisis. Seat. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, give it to the mayor. Uh, oh, but Rufus, you're not untouchable, low tech. Don't you ever forget that. That's enough. I think you're done. Uh, come on, Gizmo. You have more important things to do. Don't tell me how to do my work. Or are you just trying to divert my attention from your guilt? What? That's simply... Aha! Here is the missing clue. The last piece that completes the puzzle. The mystery of the thieving mayor has finally been wow, solved. Wow, okay. Thieving mayor? How dare you? Put up your hands, Lothek. I have no intention of lifting my hands. You better do what I say. I don't want to. You don't have any choice. I don't? Well... You're fired. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. So what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. So what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. So what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested! You can't arrest me. You're fired. That is I arrested awkward. you first. <laughs> I. What? Well. How was that? Me. It was me. <laughs> oh. 
like her. I like her a lot. The stranger, the Elysian girl, and then you got knocked out. Goal? Where is she? How is she? She's still a bit confused. I think her implant was seriously damaged by the fall. She is conscious now, but she's just talking gibberish. Can I gibberish? Talk to her? Of course. She's lying over there. I took her into medical custody. Just don't stress her out too much. First and foremost, she needs rest. No problem. Thanks, Doctor. Oh, God. Say, did it hurt a lot when you fell from the sky? <laughs> uh, well, come on, that was funny. Nah. Because, I mean, you, you really fell from the sky, you know, like an angel. <laughs> Just like in the, in the pickup line. <laughs> do, do, do you get it? Do you get it? Do you get it? Do you get it? You can't fire me! You're arrested! You can't arrest me, you're fired! Oh, man. Uh, slash dash gazash? <laughs> Sally, um, good, oh, granny. Grumblump? Grumblump? That's a false num num num. Num num num. Munch crunch? <laughs> Munch crunch? Attack a tick tock. Knock knock. Hello? Anyone at home? <clears throat> I'll take that as a yes with limitations. What? I don't know. I don't like that. I don't either. Ow, my foot. Sorry. She's attractive. Fun to talk to. Goal? It's me, your savior. What? No, it, it's Rufus. Yes. What? You can give me any name you like, babe. This is completely useless. That woman is completely nuts. What did I expect anyway? That she would take me to Elysium? Elysium. We need to go back to Elysium. What did you just say? Horrible things. The Organon betrayed us. Quick. We need to go back. To Elysium. Yes, yes. You, you, you were true. What happened? Is that you, Cletus? What? No. What? My name is Rufus. I saved you. Rufus? I don't understand. Where am I? You had a pretty bad fall. The doctor says that you're that's confusing, but uh, I need to get to Cletus. Can you take me to him? Who is Cletus? My fiance. Well, I don't know. Maybe you won't see for later. After all, you He'll reward you generously. Oh, that, that generously, you say? Try to contact Cletus. He will search for me. Yeah, yeah. How generous exactly is Oh my god. Dude! You can reach him using a radio. He's certainly trying to find me. Do you really think that's a good idea? Either Cletus is going to be an ass. Really make much of an effort to protect you. Oh my god. Is Cletus his dad? You're the only one I can trust. And you already proved that you're of noble character. <laughs> the burden of the hero. But let's get back to the expression. I yes. just swear to God, Rufus. Rufus! Contact Cletus. I would be so very thankful. So very, very thankful. Sorry, I don't know if I could do that. Can spell when Tom will follow lollipop? But the burden of the hero. Why do I always have to be so infinitely generous? Yay. Okay. Alrighty, so now we have we have to contact Venus. Yeah. 
I like the like do 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 do. All right, so break into the post office. How? We need to go to the assembly hall. All right. Oh no, we need to talk to Lottie first. Good old Lottie. Lottie. In the oh, in the town hall. Hello, Lottie. You again? <laughs> you, you again? Oh, uh, where can I make a radio Do you know call? where I can make a radio call? You should talk to the operator. You'll find him at the post office. But the post office is closed. Well, I guess in that case, my suggestion was a bit of a letter, wasn't it? Is it my turn already? Yes, it is. I already <coughs> called your number. Didn't I? I'll skedaddle. Don't let the door hit you. Go to the assembly hall. It take the clock. I'll take the funnel while I'm at it, too. What is that podium thing? Take the clock. What is... Oh. oh, I guess we'll just take the whole thing, put that uh, in our pocket. I guess. Uh, go to the opening hour sign. Dick reminds me of like, you know, Hunger Games and stuff like that. Uh, put the clock in the thing. Um, I think the post office is open. Me, oh my, I think you're yeah, right. You didn't expect that now, did ya? No. No, right? <laughs> Go into the post office. Is it run by a robot? Alright. Alright, hold on. This is complicated. There's a hatch that I can act with. See if that's the only thing. And the operator's platform. Alright, so talk to the post bot? Yes. Uh Hi, please state your business. Can I make a radio call? Uh, yeah. Where can I make a radio call? Outgoing radio calls can be made from every registered private radio device. Where would I find one of these registered mm -hmm. private devices? There is no radio device registered for long distance calls. What's that supposed to mean? It has to be possible to make outgoing calls somehow. Not while using a private radio device. Are there absolutely no long-distance devices? There are no long-distance devices except the listening post of the post office and the reserve system in the vault. Well, so there are two of them after all. Both devices are not cleared for public use. Damn. Uh, is there other devices registered? Are there other radio devices registered? There are three registered devices for local calls. One is situated in the mayor's office, another at the front desk counter in the town hall, the communication system of the emergency. Is the third one. But it's only possible to make internal calls from there. Well, that's perfect. Um, can we enter the vault? May I enter the vault? Over the corroded remains of my wrecked body. Okay. I think I can arrange that. Jeez. Do 
dude, you're no fun at all. I mean, don't you ever have some fun on your job? Be fun, fun. Man, you're hopeless. I'm talking about F-U-N. Like when someone falls into an open sewer right in front of your eyes or accidentally sets fire to his own foot. Destruction is fun. Yes, as long as it's not happening to you. I like popping the bubbles in bubble wrap. Is okay, that that's fine. Fun? Whoa, if you're into that kind of thing. Unfortunately, I only ever need bubble wrap to bad packages that contain smaller objects which have accidentally been put into boxes on postage level three, and that very rarely ever happens. But when it happens, I guess it's party all around, right? <laughs> What's that scratching noise? Is that coming from behind the hatch? Yes. It's the Postal Service replacement cat scratches you catch. The scratching from behind the hatch matches that of Postal Service replacement cats exactly? It's the unlatched Postal Service replacement cat's hatch. Wow. I, um. I want to place a forwarding request. Take the reason for your forwarding request. Well, I'll be living in Elysium in the future. Self-importance error. Uh, go to the operator platform on the left side. See you later. And talk to the phone operator. Hey, Yoohoo! Hello. Hmm. Yeah. What's up? How's work? Everything's calm here, except for those strange radio calls from this Cletus or something. I haven't had any work at all this morning. Cletus? That was a call from me. I have to talk to him at once. No chance, Bubba. The radio station is meant for postal services personnel only. You shouldn't even be up here. I have to make an urgent call. Uh-huh. And what, pray tell, has that got to do with me? Well, you're the one with the radio. Keep your hands off. This device is for postal service personnel only. You can transmit till you've got foam coming out of your ears if you want to. But you're not using this device. Capiche? Well, can I at least borrow your headphones? Are you mad? I need those for work. Nice pigeons. Our messenger pigeons? Yeah, those are magnificent creatures, aren't they? <laughs> if you like contagious diseases. Did you know they take their bearings from the planet's magnetic field? Really? How do you know? I once tied strong electromagnets around their necks. The fools immediately flew the wrong way. Is that so? Yeah, straight towards this rusty mountain of metal over there. Hmm. You're not too busy up here, are you? Um, all right, next time on Saw Guys Gaming, uh, we will move on to another thing. <laughs> They're messing with me, right? This is Kuvac. I'm as chilled out as can be. What? Pray tell? Should wear me out here? Well, uh, maybe looking at stupid. Yeah, like he's one to talk. <laughs> yeah, I know. All right, yeah. next time on Saw Guys Gaming, we will continue on with, uh, this messing game. with these pigeons. Yeah,